Hey guys, today we are going to Nassau, Bahamas. Oh my God, it was so fun. What's the most popular thing that people think about when they think of Nassau? Atlantis! Oh, that's right, <laughs> Atlantis, of course. I'm like, well that's where oh my the gosh. cruise ships register. I wanted to go to Atlantis forever. And I am so excited to say that I finally got to go. That's right. You have wanted to go for a yes. long, long time and yes. we finally did it. I don't even think I put two and two together that we were going to stop like literally right there and see it. Yeah. So, you can see it from the boat. It was awesome. Yeah, so we didn't do any excursions again. I kind of like a lot of times to look at the excursions, get ideas, and then I get off the boat. I can go either no, negotiate or do my own thing yeah. or create my own thing and yeah. just kind of not be have all these boundaries. But that's just kind of me. That's she lets me have that adventurous spirit in that regard and goes along. So thank you, I'm babe. Such You're a good wife. such an amazing wife. Yeah. <laughs> Go watch Crater Lake and you might see differently. <laughs> but anyway, so <laughs> we're on basically the top deck, 16th floor. And there is NASA. So we got off the boat and it's like, okay, how do we get to Atlantis? Well, when you come out and you go through the gauntlet of things and you're still within kind of the cage or the fencing or whatever, know, where it's the like protected a taxi. To yes. Get there. Taxi! Taxi! So you can go and line up there within the fencing, not out on the open street or whatever, and they will say, okay, stand over here, and they're waiting to get enough people for a taxi the ride. The taxis are like a van, and so they seat like eight to eight ten people. Eight people or whatever. Or like so, that. so they have know. to get a group of eight people together before they'll be like, okay, come on, let's go. Yeah. So. And there were three of us, so they're like, oh, wait over here. So, but they didn't really tell us what was going on. I'm no. telling you something that I figured out later. Yeah. So we're waiting. And waiting and, and I see on the outside of the fence on the street I'm like yeah there's taxis people get in so I said ladies stay here I'm gonna go check it out so I go talk through the fence they're like oh you want a taxi yeah come over here and so you know how much and I'm kind of seeing and, and it was pretty soon it was a little bit cheaper not much long story short it worked out okay we yeah. still drove in a van they, we didn't have to wait nearly as long. Though. We didn't have to wait as long. They they paired us with another family of four or something. So it actually worked out really well. I think that the fare includes the bridge toll because typically taxis, like they have a sticker or whatever. At the end, when we paid, I didn't know any of this. He's like, okay, it's this much for the taxi ride. And then, oh, and you need this much more. I go, for what? And he goes, for the toll. For the bridge toll. And I didn't want to <laughs> argue. It wasn't much money. But I mean, just, you know, talk about or negotiate all that up front so you got everything clear. I, I don't like to have things added on at the end and be yeah, like, wait a minute, yeah. what's going on? But a toll is a toll. So we went over the big bridge, which is quite a view actually. If you get in on it on the left side, you can see the cruise ships and then Atlantis. That was pretty neat. It was very cool. That's where we're going. The Atlantis right. Hotel. And then dropped us off. We walked in, didn't really know where we were going in Atlantis. It was kind of confusing all the well, different first of shops. All, the and... taxi or the Uber or whatever it is, they cannot drive you right up to the entrance of Atlantis. Like they kind of drop you off just outside of the little shopping area and then you have to walk in. Mm. So struggling walker. <laughs> right, that's true. Yeah, and we wandered around kind of exploring Atlantis, but we're like, well, how do we get out there? You know, like to the big pools and the, yeah. and the big lagoon and, and you know, all that stuff that you yeah. see. And uh -huh. well, so we finally figured out and worked our way down the stairs to the door to the entrance of that and there's a guard right there. Oh, the guard. Hold on. And this person, I won't give their identity or gender or whatever. I don't want to yeah. get anybody in trouble. Right. But this security guard, they said, you got to show your room key or that you bought a ticket to spend the day. Yes, <clears throat> tickets to get in. There's like different sections of Atlantis. There's like the coral reef and there's the aquarium and then there's the water park. So there's tickets for each section or you can buy a ticket full day, full pass. day pass for all of them. And that was like anywhere from 150 to $250 per person, depending on you and know, I think if the, it's like a holiday or a weekend. So. Yeah, I think the 150 was actually light. I think it, she was saying it was 200 plus. Oh, maybe yeah, you're right. Maybe even yeah, 299 so, or something. Yeah. It, it was a decent amount. And we had three of us and we're like, I don't think I want to spend a thousand dollars just to come see it and hang out. So we're good. Yeah. But I said, hey, you know, um, <laughs> I'm like, how can I get in there? 
So I asked the guard, I said, hey, any chance, any other way? We just want to shoot some video for our YouTube channel. We're not planning on staying the day. And the guard said, well, you know, you could uh, kind of show me your key from the ship. Maybe have a little- Be generous. Be generous. That's what it was. She goes, you could be <laughs> generous if you know what I mean. And I go, I know what you mean. Gotcha. So I went around the corner. I got my room key and got, I did $20. I know that's not that generous, but I thought, well, what the heck? Let's see if it works. I gave the key and the guard took it and said, thank you. And then opened the door Let and off in. we were in. And, and as you can see from this video, you walk right out and there's turtles, and like tons of tons turtles of floating turtles. around, oh swimming my gosh. around, it was waterfalls. And then you so walk cool. a little farther and it was stingrays. Oh, that's right. And oh there were gosh, tons of stingrays. So awesome. It was like this whole like pod of stingrays and there was a guy out there feeding them in the water with them and they were just swimming Hundreds. all around. Oh Hundreds. my God, it was so awesome. It was awesome, yeah. They weren't like the really, really big Monsters, ones, but they, yeah. were, they were like, I don't know, like yeah. this big, they were big. And then we walked a little farther and then we saw, we looked down over this kind of wall and there's this lagoon, but there's big, fish swimming in there. You can guess where we're at, I'm sure. It really is amazing. Beautiful. The fish, just, There's it's awesome. There's crazy big fish here. It's yeah. awesome. I don't even know what they are. Right on the other side of it is this big kind of restaurant like bar. A round restaurant. Really pretty cool, kind of a center point of Atlantis or yeah. whatever. Well, what we didn't know is there's stairs going underneath that and there's a whole aquarium of everything we were looking at on top was actually aquarium underneath. So what's really cool is they have the underwater aquarium with different tunnels and tubes and there's one right there where you can walk and be underwater and it makes an elbow that way it wasn't until we went around farther and then went around a bend and then there was a tunnel going down look at this guys here's the tunnel i was telling you about there's our guy and then that was where that you can look up, up into, yeah, and see so these cool. glass. There's a, there's a tube that goes through yes. the center of the lagoon. of the water, the lagoon yeah. or whatever. And you, so you get to walk in this tube. And then when you come out the other side, then you're on the aquarium side, which is so cool. Oh yeah, on the bar side. Uh -huh. Yeah. And then you walk up and you're at the bar and restaurant. I go, that's pretty that cool. super cool. But there are guards stationed like a checkpoint. So you kind of, we had to have so like, like I said earlier, like we own the like place, the coral like we belong. Reefs. Section, and then there's the aquarium section and then there's the the water park section so yeah there's like guards making sure checking room keys when you go from each section to the next can i see your room key please yeah so, we, so a couple of them we just walked by like you know we were just pointing on talking like we belong there uh, even though we didn't have wristbands and that's kind of another way they check like giveaway so i held my bag anyway <laughs> sneaky <laughs> And so we got by that guy and then you continue on and there's rope bridges and other big sharks. They had a hammerhead uh, oh shark. Oh my gosh, that was cool. In there. I mean, there, there's, it's, it's a really cool place. Now I will say Atlantis is kind of getting a little tired in my opinion. Mm. A lot of the concrete work out there was like crumbling and different little, stuff. Needs a little refresher. Needs a little uh, revamping. Yeah. But all in all, it's still an amazing experience Pretty and cool. they have really cool stuff that you can do. So then we progressed a little farther. I wanted to get to the beach because we collect sand and yes. I was like, I am getting sand from Atlantis. Yes, that's true. <laughs> that's true. And I'll have to show you some video, some of the globes that we have in our house of just these really cool labeled sand. So you can see what we're talking about. But anyway, so we're going and we're going to hang a right to go to the, and all of a sudden in the in bushes, I didn't know this was a chair and it's the security guy. And she's like, excuse me, excuse, excuse me, me, room excuse key, me. Excuse room me. key or wristband. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hi, how are you? We're What's your name? We're getting pulled over by a cop again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see our Cosmo video. Yeah. She wouldn't let us go by. And she goes, you want to talk to the supervisor? I go, yeah, I would like to talk to the supervisor, actually. And I was very nice. I said, you know, we're shooting a YouTube episode and so on. The supervisor just on the radio is like, yeah, no, they need to leave. Um, they can go out on the beach side, though, if they want. 
but they can't come back, you know, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, which that was cool. All I wanted was to get to the beach. Yeah, we so. got what we wanted. So we got out to the beach, gorgeous, beautiful. Beautiful. Although there was a huge storm rolling in which, with lightning. That was pretty cool to see. It was, but there was nobody in the water at Atlantis because the lifeguard's like, yep, nobody in the water. We're here at the Atlantis on the beach, Kathy and Lexi. And there is a storm brewing. Look at that, look how dark it is over there. Oh my goodness. So I don't know how long we're gonna get this beautiful sunshine, but it ain't gonna be for long. There's Cabbage Beach right down there. That is not part of the um, Atlantis. That's why you got so many people down there. So that's another option for you if you're not staying at the Atlantis because they do check your wristbands and stuff, is go to Cabbage Beach. It basically adjoins the same, it's the same beach as the Atlantis. But then once the Atlantis property ended <laughs> and you go down to Cabbage Beach, which is a public beach, which is also very, also nice, very nice, super crowded. Everyone's Everybody's in, in the, the water, water, jet skiing, doing all this hilarious. stuff. It's like the storm didn't even, that's rolling in and it was moving pretty quick. Yeah. Didn't matter, they're like, yeah. If you were an Atlantis home. guest, they wanted you out of the water. They did not want that liability. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, so, yeah. exactly. Hence the reason why we're like, all right, bye Atlantis. Yeah, let's go <laughs> Cabbage Beef, baby. <laughs> so, and then we walked farther and then went up the stairs. There was like a little market there and that's where you can catch taxi, cab, whatever. Oh, and then but we, no, he likes to walk. And I love so golf. we kept walking. I love walking with you. All the way to the golf course. Our other buddies were, I didn't play golf because I wanted to spend some time with Lexi because oh. it was our first time in the Bahamas together. So sweet. Sacrifice. I would have loved to play this golf course because my buddy said it's it was the awesome. best golf course they've ever played. And I'm like, Are you I'm kidding never me? gonna live this down. Are you kidding me? <laughs> anyway, it was amazing. Apparently, I heard all about it over and over again. But man, it was great. Thanks, babe. It was so great. <laughs> I was with you, babe. That so was awesome. Good. So good. <laughs> so, and then we uh, got a taxi back to the ship, and it was an amazing day. It was awesome. It was awesome. Very cool. I highly recommend, like, just kind of doing your own thing when you get there like you don't have to do the excursions they can be extremely pricey and they're not always all they're cracked up to be yeah. you know we had some friends who did the was it the dolphins Swim with swimming pigs. with the dolphins oh, oh swimming with the pigs too we had two different ones did swimming with the dolphins and swimming with the pigs and both of them were like so disappointed the pigs it was like you didn't actually get to, get to swim with the pigs there was only like five and there was 30 people there so like hardly anyone did anything with the pigs and then the dolphins one is like it was like in this like roped off section oh well, yeah of rectangle beach. concrete yeah kinda, it was like uh, totally like pin. sectioned in and and like it was like one person at a time got to get in with and there was like two dolphins and like you got <laughs> 10 minutes or something yeah so, so not anyway, what it's cracked up to be i'm sure some excursions are great but it is kind of fun to go do your own thing although i would say have somewhat of a plan not super regimented plan. but have a rough plan an idea yeah. a direction you're going and all that and then let it unfold as you go yeah it's it could be fun. some of the best adventures or trips you've had we went off to the atlantis you know pretty pricey to stay there and you get all the fun stuff and it's all included if you stay if at you the stay hotel there. you get to go to the water park and the beaches and the paradise cove and everything it's all included if you stay at the hotel if you're not staying at the yeah. hotel then you have to buy a day pass to get into all the fun water park stuff and the beaches and all of that and that's how much that? Pricey. I think yeah. it's like 250 bucks or something yeah. for the day. Well, it ranged anywhere from 150 to 200 dollars. All right, you guys. Hey, put busy. a comment below if you've been to Nassau and you had something fun that you did, or if yeah, because I'm sure we'll go again. So if there was something that we missed that we should have done, please tell us. Or if you had a great story, like I love stories, right? About yeah. what your adventure was in Nassau. People love that. Did they you read sneak the comments. into Atlantis too? <laughs> right. Bye, Thanks, guys. guys. See Take you next care. Time. Bye, bye.